The deadly attack left 137 people dead and over 100 people wounded, still fighting for their lives. In the video, camouflaged gunmen opening fire as people begin screaming and ducking behind seats as gunshots echoed. In the end, flames engulfed City Hall as the building collapsed. Russian President Vladimir Putin suggesting that Ukraine was linked to the attack. That's something that leaders in Kyiv and the administration also deny. Vice President Kamala Harris also pushing back against the Russian president's comments. No, there is no whatsoever any evidence. And in fact, what we know to be the case is that ISIS-K is actually and by all accounts responsible for what happened. Now domestic concerns spread at home as lawmakers sound the alarm. We have millions of Americans who live or travel abroad throughout Europe and Asia, embassies, businesses there. So I'm deeply worried that ISIS from Afghanistan will end up targeting Americans sooner rather than later. <laughs> A new video of the suspects linked to the attack today show them being brought into the courtroom. One of the suspects was blindfolded, removed to reveal a black eye. All this as Russians mourn the loss of life today, setting up candles that light up 2203-2024, a day that will likely never be forgotten. And meanwhile, in Europe, France raised its terror alert warning to the highest level following Friday's attack. Natasha. All right, Alina Shirazi with that live in Washington. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.